do that. What's going on, everybody? It is yours truly, Mr. Elliot. I pray each and every one of y'all doing simply amazing. It is almost the end of October, and it is time for episode number three. I was about to say tres, but three. Uno, dos, tres of uh, my HBCU experience. Hashtag sound effect goes in here. I'm just playing. Senior year, you guys. Oh my gosh, we are basically halfway through my senior year. I'm going off the dome with this video. As you see, I have on paraphernalia. It says HBCU made. Ugh, ugh, ugh. This shirt is by Hype Creations on Instagram. Um, I will try to leave their uh, website down below if you guys wanted to pick up one of these. Uh, sweaters, they have sweaters, hoodies, uh, t-shirts, all kinds of stuff. I'll leave the information down below. Support black businesses. Um, this is the Royal Blue and White. Um, I got this last year, so I don't think they have this design anymore, but I'm, I'm pretty sure you can just look on the website and see. That is neither here nor there. Um, I want to discuss my actual topic for my senior project. You know, last episode I talked about I was going to reveal, reveal, yeah, reveal my senior project topic. And uh, I'm going to do that in this video uh, later on. And what am I going to talk about? Homecoming. TSU Homecoming was flipping amazing. My last homecoming as an undergrad at Tennessee State University was amazing. No, I did not blog it, but there are plenty vlogs uh, here on YouTube of the band and the pep rally and uh, the step show, the concert. Um, but really the only thing that I did, guys, uh, was I participated in the Gospel Explosion. Some of you may or may not know that I sing with the greatest, 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 greatest choir in the world. The uh, New Direction Gospel Choir of Tennessee State University, award-winning New Direction Gospel Choir of Tennessee State University. Um, I love that choir. That gospel concert was hosted by uh, Carlton Holmes, Holmes, uh, aka not Carlton Banks on Instagram. You know the guy who does all the church parodies on Instagram. He hosted it. He did an amazing job. He brought in Lily and Miss Squeak and all those people and it was very funny as you guys can see on uh new directions uh instagram page i will leave their link or our link down below so you guys can see we did an amazing job uh starting off homecoming and i didn't go to any like the pep rallies or like the battle of the residence halls or coordination site do job have a job so couldn't do that but i did go to the uh parade and uh, some of the tailgating festivities after the parade. But I did not make it to the game, but we won. So shout out to all of my Tigers. Um, if you do go to Tennessee State University, uh, leave me a thumbs up down below. And um, if you guys go to another HBCU, let me know uh, how your homecoming went as well. But uh, like I said, I am almost done with my senior project. Um, I'm about 11 pages out of my 20 pages that I want to do. So, pretty much halfway done, you guys, so keep praying for me. But my topic is, uh, does the absence of a father cause juveniles to commit delinquent acts? Again, does the absence of a father cause juveniles, or you can say youth, minors, uh, people under the age of 18, to commit uh, delinquent acts, okay? So, delinquent acts, you can Google that, what that means, but... That is basically what's going on. Like I said, nothing really going on. Just working and trying to bust my ass to get through the senior year. Shout out to everybody who is class of 2017. Whether you graduate uh, next month in December. Wait, wait. Month after next in December. Or in May like myself. Uh, shout out to you guys. You know, we made it. Push through. You guys know some of my friends are struggling and really going through a lot. Y'all go ahead and push through. We are almost done with our undergraduate undergraduate uh, career. So you guys, we can do it, but that is neither here nor there, you guys. I love you. Continue to pray for me as I complete my senior year. Like I said, ain't nothing really going on over here. 
and uh, continue to make it do what it do. And all you do, make sure you like my previous HBCU experience updates, hashtag senior year, as well as like this one, okay? Go ahead and like it. Go ahead and like it. Go ahead. Go ahead. I'm just playing. But uh see you guys on episode number four in November, you guys. I love you guys. Bye.